marvelous. I'm looking forward to it. Very well. See you back.
Hey, Yukatan. You ever check out the student message boards and stuff? You know how last week that girl was found by the front gate? Well, now, they're saying it was an angry spirit from this one ghost story that did it. Come on, nobody really believes that stuff, right? What's this ghost story about? What? It's probably made up. We don't need to go into details, do we? I'm interested. Go on, tell us. Mm. You got it. Here goes. Good evening, and welcome to Junpei's Believe It or Don't. There are many strange things in this world. Legend has it, late at night, after everyone has gone home, a maniacal ghost roams the halls and devours anyone caught in its grasp. The other day, this friend of mine, let's call him Witness A. Anyway, he said to me, Hey, Iori, I saw something weird the other day. He sounded so serious, so I asked him what he'd seen. He told me he saw the girl from 2E and claims he watched her go into the school on the night before the incident. I told him I don't believe it, not even for a second. from 2E ain't the type to go wandering around at night. But Witness A was as white as a sheet. He swore to me it was true. Then it hit me. If the girl was found unconscious at school, then maybe the ghost really did make her its dinner. It all made sense. She went to the school at night and walked right into its deadly trap. I felt a chill run down my spine and I broke into a cold sweat. Yes, there truly are some strange things in this world. Believe it, or don't. What do you think, Akihiko? Seriously? Not one word about my amazing performance just now? I'm not so interested in the ghost part, but it does sound like it's worth investigating. So, you're afraid of ghosts, huh, Yukata? I didn't know you were such a chicken. What? Who are you calling a chicken? Fine then, let's investigate it. Each of us will ask around for the rest of the week and gather information. This ghost story is just a bunch of nonsense. I'll show you. Sounds good to me. The story is a bit unnerving, isn't it? Huh? Well, leave it to you guys then. Would have been too scary for me. Let's see. Oh? Oh, goodness, no.
Good evening. I'm back, just as I promised. How have you been? I'm glad you remember me. In another week, the moon will be full again. The next ordeal will be upon you. Be careful. Until next time. Morning. Hey, listen. So, in this section... Yes, precisely! Emiri is... oh, that's Miss Kano's first name. Anyway, Emiri's really popular with the guys. And I kind of took her away from them, you know? Like she became my girl before they even had a chance. Turns out Emiri's a really strict teacher when it comes to grades. At home, though, she's a real sweetheart. I love how her attitude changes when she's with me. Yeah, good-looking people just flock together, you know? It's like a law of attraction. I'm just messing around, man. Don't take me so seriously. Well, Emiri is pretty gorgeous. Anyway, what about you? Make any progress with Takeba-san? I feel guilty hogging all the happiness, so I'm gonna wish for you to be happy, too. 
hey, don't tell anyone about me and Emiri, okay? Because teachers aren't allowed to date students. I only told you because I trust you. Shoot, look at the time. I'm way behind on my favorite show. Well, I guess that's because real life is way better than any show right now. as a family. We used to do it all the time. How come mom and dad don't get along anymore? I know. I'll just ask them why. If I know why, I can fix it and make it all better. I'm gonna make mom and dad happy again. Wish me luck, okay? Yeah. Hey. So 